touching moment Kate and William received flowers from boy dressed as Grenadier Guard, image, Getty. Kate, Princess of Wales, had a taste of home during her three-day trip to Boston today as she received flowers from an eight-year-old boy dressed as one of Buckingham Palace's Grenadier Guards. Adorable Henry Dine of Teixeira, from Somerville, Massachusetts, gave the princess a bouquet of red roses as he beamed from beneath his iconic bearskin hat. Kate and Prince William had just come from a visit to Greentown Labs, North America's largest clean tech incubator, on the second day of their visit to the Boston area, when Henry had approached them on the street. Henry's mum, Irina, said of his wonderful costume, he saw changing of the guard on a visit to London and wore it for Halloween, reported Express. Co.ux Richard Palmer. The pair shook Henry's hand as they met him, image, Getty, Henry's mum said he had been inspired to get the outfit after seeing it in London, image, Getty. Both Kate and William shook the young boy's hand, and could be seen exchanging a few words with him. Henry told reporters the experience was crazy, adding that he wasn't actually that nervous when he spoke to the prince and princess. When asked what he is going to tell his friends, Dinah Teixeira said he was going to scream to his best friend and tell them I am famous. Soon after the meeting, the Prince and Princess of Wales tweeted out their thanks to Henry and everyone who came out to see us in Somerville this morning. The sweet moment has already moved fans, with many remarking on how cute Henry's gesture was. One said, such a dear little boy, while another added, this young man is so cute, love him. Young Henry gave Kate a bouquet of red roses in a very sweet gesture, image, Getty. After setting down in Boston yesterday, the couple's trip officially began with a private meeting with Boston Mayor Michelle Wu in her office, before a welcome event outside City Hall, which saw local Bostonians packed outside armed with flowers, flags and umbrellas to brave the heavy rain and welcome the royals to their city. Top-notch security for the couple will be provided by the U.S., with agents of the Diplomatic Security Service DSS, having reportedly started planning their protection back in September. Matthew O'Brien of the DSS Boston Field Office told ABC News that their trip has been choreographed down to the minute.